the GE Innova um, uh, Cath Lab with AutoWrite uh, gives us fantastic quality images, but importantly also gives me confidence that the radiation exposure is as low and as optimised as it can be. NHS Highland covers a huge area about the size of Belgium, the size of Wales. We are a general cardiology department. We, we provide general cardiology care for all of the, the patients of the Highlands. So travel from the top, the north to the south of Highland would take nine hours. Getting patients access in an emergency situation to the cath lab can be challenging. One of the ways to address these challenges is to make sure that our communication uh, pre-hospital is as good as it can be. So we work extremely closely with the Scottish Ambulance Service and our coronary care nurses. And we take over 3,000 ECGs per year through our coronary care unit. What's important in our daily PCI practice is a good team that knows the, um, the equipment to make sure everything's working well. So, you know, reliability from the cath lab equipment is really very important. So we need to be able to treat people here on site without having to rely on other sites. Since our purchase of the new IDS AutoWrite, we found that there has been a significant dose reduction, um, specifically in long cases or cases which previously would have had a very high dose. And the image quality, especially with the big screen, has been fantastic. The quality of image that we're seeing on lower doses compared to our older generation systems is very, very good. The new AutoWrite system takes a lot of the guesswork out of the radiographers and lets them be assured that if they select the correct protocol, it's all been set up to optimise for that patient. What I'd like to see more of is the use of AI in order to limit the dose um, and optimise image quality, relying on humans to implement real-time changes to what's going on in the calf lab always is going to be um, limited by training and time. So I think the more involvement from the device and the equipment, the better, because I think that's going to be the future in dose optimization. The case involved an 86-year-old woman who had thrombolysis for a and myocardial infarction. She was out with 90-minute travel time and was transferred to our hospital. It was obvious there was calcification in the vessels and therefore I did a lot of balloon predilatation to stretch the artery. Two stents were deployed. Stents themselves were well opposed, but the distal stent edge had a dissection. I was able to measure using OCT what required to happen, and a further stent was deployed with an excellent angiographic result. What we found with the IGS in new calf lab from GE is that it does integrate very well with the other modalities that we have in the calf lab, including intravascular ultrasound and optical coherence tomography. We have a relatively high usage of these technologies in this cath lab, around 30 to 40 percent. We like to have easy access to the images on the same GE display. StentVis is phenomenal. How quick it is to deliver the images and the image quality is absolutely phenomenal. I think that's been one of the biggest improvements for me. For most PCIs, we're using it routinely to ensure that we have got good expansion of the stent, but more importantly, to optimise the placement of the balloon to ensure the stent is fully post-dilated. The radiographer's role here is quite serious. They're in charge of radiation protection in the lab as well as the actual imaging during the case. The image quality has been fantastic in complex um, scenarios. I do think the GE systems are very user-friendly. Everything is very easy to pick up. The day this lab went live, we had two primary PCIs sat out on the doorstep and the radiographers, the cardiologists, had never been in the lab. So the fact that that team felt confident enough to walk into a familiar system and do those two patients without hiccup was a phenomenal achievement. In our cath lab here in NHS Highland, we have an active and keen interest in limiting radiation dose both to patients and to staff. We are looking to integrate the dose map information into our audit process. It's really important to have a very close relationship with the company that provides the cath lab equipment. So we have a long history with GE and they understand that we rely on them a lot in terms of our remoteness and our single cath lab. The GE choice was a perfect option because it allowed us to upgrade our existing system put the new one in, we had very minimal build changes. The actual project, which was led by GE, was incredibly efficient and went perfectly to time. 
we couldn't have done this if the communication lines hadn't been that good being in such a remote spot and I think that's very important because once you buy a piece of equipment like this that support needs to be lifelong. So it was fantastic to work with a company like GE who did what they said they would do and completed the task on time.